All right, so I went and took the old piston off, got the new one sort of on there, lined up. I've already installed the little clip that you can see that guy there inside. And I'm going to very gently try to push this wrist pin down onto this connecting rod with one hand, which is going to be tricky. There it goes. So you can see it's in now. And then we're going to take a tool and very gently push that inside like that. So you can see, if you look, there's a small divot for the extra pin to go into. Now this can be tricky, so I'm going to take two hands and do it. Good. Next, what we're going to want to do is find the locating pin on the piston. You see there's a crack in the ring there. And you want to line that locating pin up with the pin, which is, happens to be sitting right there. Take your new base gasket. Sometimes they're labeled up and down, sometimes they're not. This one doesn't seem to be. Prop it on top like that. Now take your lube. And give the piston a little bit of lube. Well, the top really doesn't matter so much. It's more the sides where the ring sits and in the groove. So you want to make sure you get some lube in there. She goes together nice and easy. And we take our new cylinder. It's also a good idea. Just put a little tiny bit of lube in there. Um, figure out which is your front and which is your rear. I believe in this case uh, it goes like this. Now this you got to be careful. You want to stand your piston up so you can hold it from underneath. Make sure that your pin and your locator grooves don't move. And you want to kind of very gently slide and squeeze those rings up into the jug. When you get it, you'll know. There it goes. So, she'll kind of very gently slide down like that. Careful not to twist or scrape the gasket. Get it caught anywhere it shouldn't be. Drop it down on top. And there you go. Looks like she's on there. Um, there's a new gasket for the intake right there, which sits down in between the carburetor boot and the cylinder. Then you've got your four bolts. Uh, one, two, three, four, which are the four that you took apart before. Your muffler, your shield, your shield, your muffler spark plug, your covers, etc. We'll bolt the sucker all together, torque it, and uh, I'll take it outside and we'll, we'll try and fire it up.